welcome to the channel i bowan today i have a toyota yaris 2009 i'm going to do front brake disc and pad wait with me need to jack up the car first take out the uh, rim cover jack up for certain level no need to jack up very higher going to remove wheel nut this is the caliper holding spring put it flat screw drive and you can take out uh, like this now need to push in piston you can use flat screw drive and push in i'm going to take out two dust cover for caliper pin going to remove two slider pin it's number 7 allen key caliper leave it like that this is the old brake pad one here this is the outer one that's one same as a inner one now i'm going to remove caliper runner it's holding it two bolts 17 mm runner out this is the old this that one also worn before you put in new parts make sure compare with the old one identically same if it not don't going to put in now i am going to clean uh, brake disc with the uh, brake cleaner because this uh, brake disc come with the oil coating make sure before you put it in clear properly otherwise uh, brake not holding properly need to clean caliper and also properly otherwise ending with the binding brake or uneven wear brake pad because of that make sure clean it properly and apply little bit tiny grease around that area i am going to put caliper and back top bolt i can't use the gun no space there because of that i'm using a ratchet compare with the new pad and old pad so see this is the wrong pad this is not a correct pad this pin wrong way this is the correct one better to always check before you put in this is slide the pin make sure that one also clean properly and apply tiny bit uh, copper grease don't going to apply too much it's enough for just tiny this is the other slider pin that can also need to clean like a previous one and apply little bit copper grease apply a bit grease edge of the brake pad don't going to apply too much copper grease make sure only apply the 
brake pad they just don't going to apply around this area going to tight two slider pins don't going to over tight put it dust cap back this is the little bit uh, harder part but I'll let you know easy way first you need to push it in one side and after that you can use in like a plier and give the pressure to in and the other edge you can push in from finger like this if you use in bigger adjustable flyer you can do it easily I'm going to put tire back before that uh, I'm going to clean surround that area because there is a little bit uh, fingerprint there make sure this surface clean it nicely it's clean now I'm going to put uh, tire first couple of thread I'm going to do by hand after that I'm going to use gun because sometimes I use the gun can be go prone thread this is the very important thing don't going to forget after you do the break make sure press the brake pedal four or five times until it's getting hard otherwise when you take road straightly brake not holding sufficient thanks for watching i'm charlie from sanu motors